Okay, guys, what's Bambi TV? Guys, don't be reacting to men give the original woman a reality check. <laughs> Whoa. Guys, let's get straight into this. There's levels to this in every game. It's and just like question. business in what general. Are, just to be clear, what are you? Prime. You're prime? Top notch. What makes you time, prime, top notch, who tank? Uh, I mean, I have everything that you could possibly ask for as far as brains, beauty, ambition. I would build my man up to be everything he wants to be in this world. I'm, I'm the best investment he would ever make in his life. Really modest as well by the sounds of things. And my shit's exclusive. I've invested in my body. I have a $150,000 body. No one barely touches me. Yes, you can see me on Instagram because I'm paid to do that, but nobody touches me unless a man, yes, does take care of me. I like bosses. I like millionaires. I like someone who's going to mentor me, teach me, and invest in me. And get me to my highest level as well. Your shit ain't exclusive if it's free for people to see on Instagram. And just to be clear, what's a $150,000 body? Uh, four BBLs, two breast augment, technically five BBLs, but so we're gonna cyborg. go with four. Uh, two breast augmentations, obviously Botox, Botox, lips and lip injections, and then I had the fat buckle removed out of my cheeks on my face. Wow. And how young are you? 28. Damn. 28 and she's completely fake. She's made of plastic, bro. And I guarantee even after spending all that money on her face, she's still terrified of baby wives. 28. And what age do you want to get married? Uh, I don't necessarily have a time restraint on myself. I feel like God's going to, you know, make me cross paths with my future husband when that time is right. Keep telling yourself. <laughs> so are you comfortable? I probably have about another 10 million in real estate that I need to develop before that. Um, so that I can reach the caliber of man that I want to be my future husband. Men that are worth a serious amount of money tend to not give a shit about how much the woman makes. It's more about the way she looks and the way she acts. Got it. And how convinced are you that a man is attracted to a girl with ambition, brains, $10 million in real estate, or just being nice and sweet? What do you think a man is most interested in, especially the man that you're looking for who's worth millions of dollars? Does he want to... A, a, an ambitious boss babe or a nice compliant beautiful girl that doesn't give him headaches what do you think most men like that would prefer i don't I, i'm not looking for what most men or most well you should be because you want like. that kind of guy so you what should do be you mean? I, no i'm looking so for I'm like asking, that, that one in a million where i'm you're looking at like grant and elaine cardone you're looking at okay. like you know power couples jay-z beyonce those people are building an empire together if she wants a one in a million man and she's not going to get anywhere with an attitude like that and let's be honest she's not that special and obviously she's still got the mind of a teenage girl she's comparing what she wants in a relationship to what celebrities have but let's play in reality right now you're not going to marry jay-z or grant cardone for the sake of this conversation you're going to marry some no, successful guy I'm have exactly my own. <laughs> exactly so that guy how much is he worth Close Make to up a number. A hundred million. Okay, so that guy that's worth a hundred million dollars, yes. go with me here now, yes. Kay. Does he want a boss babe who's trying to sell real estate or a trying? nice, lovely, compliant girl who's willing to get on his schedule? What do you think that guy wants? Think about it. Uh, well, I only date men that are at that high. No, caliber. no, no. I'm asking so, what uh, you think. I don't care what you think. I want to know. I think they want me. What he They're thinks. They're constantly pursuing me. I doubt it. <laughs> What do you mean? Why, why aren't you married to one yet, though? Because I don't want to be married to one yet. I thought you just I've been said building you... my own business. But I thought I've you... been proposed to twice and turned it down. It wasn't you the right one. You turned down a guy worth $100 million twice? Mm, $50 million. Why the fuck you lying? Why? why you always lying? But yes. Why in the world would you turn him down? Because I still have things to do. So you think that you're just going to go find another guy <laughs> worth $50 million is ready to wipe no, you up? No, I, like I said, $100 million. I like to okay, double down. Okay, so the $50 million guy was just... Too poor for you. No, he just wasn't the right one. I'm calling complete bullshit on this. I think she's chatting out of her ass to sound interesting on a podcast and she's just making it up on the spot. If it is true and she's actually turned down two men that are worth $50 million and she's going to regret that shit forever because I don't think a poor man's even going to want her. You do realize there might be people in the comments calling you absolutely delusional right now. That's do you fine. realize that? I don't care what they have to say. Okay. So I'm asking you I to put yourself... <laughs> take off the I'm a hot girl, paid 150 grand, boss, babe. Okay. Priceless Punani, take that off. Okay. Give me a guy's name that you'd be willing to marry. A guy's name. Hundred million dollar guy. I don't. I don't know. Let's call him Jay Z. Let's call him. <laughs> let's call him Jay, because okay. we're not talking of Jay Z. Jay is worth a hundred million dollars. Uh -huh. Do you think? Think about it. Money. He cares how much money you make. No. You don't. Okay. Let's stop there. Do you think he cares about your attitude? He, uh, to an extent, yeah. To an extent. Yeah. He cares so a lot about your cares attitude. He cares a lot about your attitude. Yeah. But I have a great attitude. Now, no, you okay. don't. <laughs> oh, my God. 
you're not worth $100 million, so your opinion doesn't matter. Okay, so listen to me. You just said you so turned So only a person that's worth $100 million opinion yeah. matters? As far as me like being in an intimate relationship, okay. yeah. Oh, that's a great attitude. He's not worth $150 million. He's just a peasant. Is this some sort of peasant joke that I'm too rich to understand? <laughs> what is Jay looking for? If this particular Jay wants a simple Sarah, then you can find a million of those. You can go to the club, you can go find a girl in college, or it's something so simple like that. You can find them, a, like every hundred girls is the same person like that, simple. I'm one in a million as well. And a hundred million dollar man usually likes the extraordinary. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm attracting the extraordinary. Can I ask you? I'd actually say she's repelling the majority. All she cares about is a man's net worth. Any man with brains is gonna stay away from her. She's got no emotional feelings. All she cares about is materialistic shit and money. What do you think that a man in general, like you said, a hundred million dollars is a guy that is worth talking Queen, to. Queen, I don't even know why you're talking to her right I now, know, bro. You're I not even know. worth a hundred million dollars. It's okay, you know what I'm it's okay. okay. Like, what are the top three things that you think that man values? I think he values business. They're looking for someone that they can procreate with, someone to take on their legacy. Do you think that they want to pro procreate with someone who thinks like you as opposed to a compliant, submissive woman? I would, I would assume so, yeah. If you don't get it, forget about it. Now, I don't think it's a bad thing that she wants to have her own business and make her own money. I just think her attitude is what shit. She doesn't really seem to me that she'd make a very loving mother. And I think a lot of men, when they look at the woman they're going to have a kid with, they want her to have maternal feminine instincts. And she doesn't really seem to have that. She seems like she'd be cold. That's not what men value. They don't want, like, a aggressive, you know, dominant woman that cares more about money and real estate, millions of dollars, as opposed to being a respectful, loyal, compliant woman. They just don't. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to help you out, because, you know, you just turned down a... a Get us worth fifty million dollars. Yeah, acting like they just down the street, like you know what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> I mean, did she though? If we're being honest, probably not. Yeah. Uh, would you say that you're agreeable? To no, just in general, would you say you're more agreeable or more disagreeable? Just answer the damn question. Depends on the in topic. general, like topic. so. For instance, if you ask me, Adam, are you agreeable or disagreeable? I'm disagreeable as. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm deceptive. Okay. So you too. I'm very deceptive. Yeah. Okay. If that dude comes along, do you think he wants an agreeable woman or a non-agreeable, disagreeable woman? That dude with a hundred million dollars. What do you want? I'm asking you. I'm asking you. Yeah, you better f***ing agree, okay? Okay. Uh, <laughs> if I'm worth a hundred million dollars and I'm like, hey, baby, need you to do this. Don't be like, why am I doing this? Because that dude, you know what he has? He's got ready. Wait for it. Options. options. Like so, if you don't get on his page, that you said, McQueen, you don't even got a hundred million dollars. Why? Are you I know, man. Just, I, dude, I don't even know why you're here right now, player. Here, I, know. <laughs> I hear what you're saying. You got confidence. You got your swag. You spent 150 grand on your body. Do your thing. Whatever. I'm just letting you know, sweetheart. The more disagreeable you get, the more you'll be packing your shit up at that dude's house. Letting I, you know. I never lived with a man. So. You've never even lived with a dude? Well, it's clear that so you, you don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it! You can't make this shit up! She can't even answer basic questions. She said herself she's disruptive. She doesn't care about people's opinions unless they're worth $150 million. And all she cares about is money. There's only one place she belongs. She belongs to the streets. That's the stuff. Like, just... I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> like, no, 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 no. I believe she's she's a powerful woman, and I feel the way she's presenting her argument isn't right, and she's making it feel like she's proud in a, in a way. Yes, I would say, but I, I feel if she takes time to think about what she said, like she just needs to think about it and rich men or women that I would disagree. I would say rich men per se. I'm not rich yet, so I I, I don't really know. Well, I would want to, and I'm there, but like men in general, like. You just want someone that will give them peace of mind, like they are hiding place where they will just chill and be happy. Like if you can bring happiness to him and find someone else, like guys, like share because my channel. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.